Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Trouble Free. In this video, I'm going to explain you about lazy learners algorithm in the subject of data mining. Actually, this is also there in machine learning. So I'm telling you again, lazy learning is nothing but you can also call it as learning from neighbors. Okay, or it is also called as learning from neighbors. Here, what it will do is it will simply store the training data and wait until it gets it as tuple. Okay, and it will work only when it gets a new example. What does it mean is so if you are training some machine whatever you have learned it uh, sorry whatever you have taught like you you taught the machine like a plus b whole square is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square this is a formula that you made your machine to learn then in case of lazy learner what will happen is when you give the values for a and b for uh, suppose your example has come a is equal to 2 and b is equal to 3 this is what you want to check this is what you want to generate right then what machine will do then it will do the analysis li like okay in place of a i have to substitute 2 in place of b i have to substitute 3 then i have to compute this after computing this i have to equate this value to this thing and then print the result so then it will start thinking then it will start analyzing when only when you send the example that is called as lazy learning that is whenever need comes okay let us do at that time we will think like right so the same here also it will think like that but in case of eager learning what will happen so as soon as you give the formula to the machine it will learn the formula it will do the analysis activity like okay if if any a b values comes then i have to substitute a and b values i have to get the output and output i have to display so all initial analysis it will do and whenever output comes it will immediately substitute the values here and it will give the output got it so that's it that is about the eager learning so in case of lazy learning it will be less training time because it will just learn it is not doing any analyzing activity right but in case of eager learning it will have more training time okay and here it has more prediction time so more prediction time why because it is doing the analysis part once you give the example but in case of eager learning you will have less prediction time because analysis is already done before itself got it so and the example for lazy learners is knn algorithm so in the exam if you are asked to write about the knn sorry lazy learning then you have to write these this few two three points and then write about the knn algorithm or they may directly ask you to write about the knn algorithm okay knn is nothing but k nearest neighbor okay so this video this algorithm i already did the video in the machine learning playlist i will give the link of that video in the description you can have a look at the knn algorithm if you have already prepared it during your machine learning and you still remember it it's well and good but you don't remember it you want to prepare it again then i will give you the link in the description box you can have a look at that video okay thanks for watching the video till the end let's meet up in the next coming video with another topic if you're still having any doubts by then let me know in the comment section Let's meet up in the next coming video with another topic. Till then, stay tuned to my channel for more and more such videos.